I am very proud to be from Illinois, and my family's history in this state goes back every single day that we've been a state. My mother's side of this family has been in Illinois for now over 200 years. I was proud to serve as the, bicent the, the co-chair of the Illinois Bicentennial Commission this past year, which was a great honor for me. But today, today is a very proud day. This week is a proud week for the people of Illinois, especially for this body. The legislative branch leads the way in Illinois. We were the first branch of government that was seated in Illinois before the executive branch, before the judicial branch. We have a tremendous history of doing great things in this body. All you have to do is look up to the painting on our side of the aisle of Abraham Lincoln to know that man served in this very institution. 200 years ago Monday, what we have down on the, in the well, that document in the well, 200 years ago Monday, the first public act was enacted in the state of Illinois. That is the actual first public act that's on display down there. Signed by Governor Shadrach Bond, Lieutenant Governor Pierre Menard, and the Speaker of the House John Messenger, the act basically says all the common laws of England apply to us. As I said, this, my family's history goes back 200 years. And if you look at Res House Resolution 80, you'll see that I listed the Senate first, which is very hard for me. But the reason I listed the Senate first was my fourth great grandfather was a guy named Lewis Barker who served as the first state senator from Pope County and actually voted on that legislation right down there. So this is really personal to me to be able to honor this today. I'd like to recognize some of the co-sponsors on this bill, Representative Wheeler and Representative Connor, who have family members who served in the 1800s in this in the General Assembly. We've got people like Representative Costello, Representative McAuliffe, Representative Turner, who've had family members serve in the General Assembly as well. I'd like to give a special thank to Clerk John Holman and our Assistant Clerk Brad Boland for allowing this document to be displayed today. It's a really intricate part of our history. And I'd certainly like to thank, back over our shoulder here on the Republican side, the staff from the Illinois State Archives are here. Kathy Popovich, Alex Dixon, Shannon Murphy, Dave Jones. Dave Jones is the executive director of the State Archives. And you have, if you haven't been to the building just to the south of this to go to the State Archives, I would, I would encourage you to do it. It's a great building. Dave Jones has been my muse for a lot of this bicentennial stuff over the last year, and I appreciate the work that he has done. So ladies and gentlemen, I appreciate the opportunity to let you all know that you can see the very first thing that this body acted on in front of you today, and I would encourage you to take a look and celebrate the great history of this state of Illinois. Thank you very much, Madam Speaker.